What's up everybody? As you saw last night in Wednesday Night League, I threw the duo again. Uh, so what I did to the duo is I took it, put it on the spinner, uh, CTD 5500 uh, hand po uh, polish on it, give it that shine back that it deserved, and it looks a lot better. Uh, so I'm going to stand at 19 and throw it all night uh, with games of 246, 266, uh, 255 for 767. Uh, and like I said, what this week was going to be was going to be about that ball. And I'm calling out all the haters of the Rotor Grip Duo right now. You want to say you don't like that ball? You say that ball's not a good ball? How many times do you throw it? Twice? Three times? Like you throw it once and then you don't like it? Or did you, or did you throw it a game and it didn't do what you wanted it to do and you couldn't score with it? Is that kind of thing? Because I'm telling you right now, that ball is amazing. Like, it's versatile. You keep the shine on it and keep it polished, it's versatile. Yeah, I've seen people put surface on it, stuff like that. But with the surface, it might ruin it. So, why are you going to put surface on it? Leave it polished. It's a pearl. Pearls are meant to be polished, not sanded. If you want something sanded, go with a hybrid. Go go with a urethane. Go with a solid. Not a polish. Not a pearl. Pearls are meant to be shiny. They're good for when you got to play the lanes. you got to play a tight tight shot because it'll get through the heads and it'll have that hold. So that's how that's this week's stuff. So uh, next week next week we have Tuesday leagues and Wednesday league plus we have the Hall of Fame. Uh, we'll see how that goes. We'll see how next week goes. I got practice today with my student rolling uh, high school districts this, this Saturday. Today we put down Stone Street. For, uh, I looked at the shots that they were, gonna, they were choosing from for districts. I just wanted to go and put down something that's going to be the exact same length. So the shots I was looking at was between 41 and 42 feet. There were some that were 40, I think it was three of them that were 42 and one was 41. So I had to put down a 42 foot shot. I put down Stone Street. Because looking at these shots, all they looked like to me was a modified house shot. So, with practice today, I'm gonna throw my shoes on, and I'm gonna throw it. I'm gonna throw throw some stones with her and see what happens. And then that way I can figure out where she needs to play. And I know, and I have never on Stone Street before. She has two new balls she's gonna be working with, and that's all I'm gonna have to throw. Well, to her, they're new. It's only that may be old. One's a radical max results, and then one's a results plus from radical. Results plus is a pearl. You got the max results, that's a solid. The pearl might work better for her on this long shot. Get her through the heads and get her down and then sort energy. Or the solid might work. But she's going to throw both, and that's when I have her throw, throw on Saturday. Saturday's going to be a long day for me. I got her. I got districts in the morning with her. And then I gotta gotta work at night. So all said and done, looking at league secretary for league last night before it was updated today. It said I needed 767 to raise my average by one. I literally shot 767 last night. Now I'm at I'm at 231 again from a Wednesday night league. Uh, it feels good to be back in my 230 average. Tuesday nights is a little rough. I'm only at 205, mainly because I'm bowling the league to where I used to know how to play them lanes and read the lanes like when they broke down a lot on the right side. But I'm getting, but like I'm starting to get there to where I can read them. I can start to read them now again. So we'll see what happens next week. That's all I have for now. Good luck to all the PBA bowlers that are rolling the tournament right now. Uh, good luck to everybody that's out at the TAT, out in the True Amateurs Tournament, out, at, out in Vegas. 
at Gold Coast. And I will see you all next week. And have a good weekend.